Crap Beer Show, part of the Crap Network, and with me as always is Broadleaf. Leaf. How you doing? Nubs. What's going on? Gray Ashes. What's going on? What the? He's excited and to try this beer. Bobby Butane. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers is right. Tonight, we're going to be drinking the Guinness Black Lager, and I'm still scared from what Gray Ashes just did. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure what happened there, but... uh. If he's excited for this beer, then maybe I should be excited for this beer too. <laughs> maybe it's pretty going to be a good one. It's a black lager, 4.5% ABV, and uh, made by the Guinness Brewing Company. We've never done a Guinness before, have we? No. It smells really good. Oh, oh, we're popping a Guinness cherry right here. Yep. And we're doing it with style with the black lager. Damn right. Yes, we are. It smells really good out of the bottle. That's just how we roll, y'all. I want to see what it smells oh, yeah. like in the glass. Yeah, it is a really dark water smell to it. Yeah. You yeah, can it definitely smell those, those malts. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah that's that's malts. malts. Yeah, that's Absolutely. Mm. It smells good. Yeah. yeah. I, 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 I kind of like the label, too. You know, I'm a label guy. I think that label's... It's yeah, yeah it's I, mean, I, I think it fits it's the... Simple, uh, the but it's simple yet refined. I mean, yeah. it's, it's eye-catching. And you see that established 17... Oh, the pour here? Ooh, it's, dark. it's coming out really dark. Man. Looks like it's a little bit thick. Yeah, real uh, syrupy. That looks wonderful. There's some uh, kind of, oh, kind of, oh, Man, it looks real dark. That is I beautiful. Like so much I like that I handle that. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap. That uh, looks like. It's all the point. I didn't get a little. <laughs> uh, I just got a little bit ahead here. I got maybe a. Holy a shit. shit. A hand and a half ahead. <laughs> hey, he's got all finger head. Uh, <laughs> the color to it is really dark. I can barely see through it. Yeah, it's I very dark. I don't know how you're seeing through anything. <laughs> I can't see through that. that, that uh, I got the light shining. Uh, dude, I can't see through that. No. I can barely, I can see, barely through. see my finger on the other side. I can I see can't. the light. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's dark. Yeah, Look it's, at all the head on on Broadleaf's glass. I got that. me some hair. All the dirt. Not hair. What's the hair? It's all on the floor, man. It's all on the floor. <laughs> hey, well, I, I like it. I like it too. I like the smell of it in the glass. Oh, wow. <laughs> it smells good. Yeah, it does. Oh, yeah. It's got kind of a mm. caramely smell. Yeah, it does. Yeah. That smells good. Oh, man. Yeah, right. yeah, it does. Ooh, man. Yeah, that smells really good. It does. It smells real good. Well, yeah. It looks like you just poured a cup of Coca Cola in there, right? Yeah. It's even got that kind of smell to it. Yeah, you don't, you don't really see much carbonation with it. No, no you don't. No, you, just all. No. you do not at all. There's, there's not carbonation in Guinness at all. <clears throat> Mine almost looks like a root beer float. <laughs> Where's the ice cream at? I wish I knew. <laughs> well, the pour was good. Yeah. The smell is good. I think we should try the taste. I think we yeah. should drink it up. I think we should do some cheers here. Yeah, Let's cheers, cheers it up. Cheers. Let's cheers it up. Cheers it up, Bellaroons. Oh, I got to move it up. All right, all right, all right. Let's just try this here. Let's here we go. Let's Let's first game is popping the cherry. Oh, that is smooth. Mm. You know, I'm shocked. I thought it was going to have a little bit of a bite to it. Yeah, yeah. No, that is for as dark as it is. Yeah, man. Real smooth. <laughs> that is crazy smooth. That is super it's, smooth. Yeah, it's it's very smooth. I, I didn't get much of a kick to it. No, there's not. There's like no bite. I'd almost be afraid to drink a lot of these because <laughs> you, you have like down. 15 of them and you wouldn't well, even know it. It is 4.5. Well, that's true. <laughs> but still, <laughs> so you'll probably be okay on a six pack. Oh yeah. But damn, I mean, I I, I really thought with this being as dark as it was, oh, I thought yeah, it would have a little bit of a bite. Smooth. Honestly, like, regular, regular Guinness regular does. Guinness for me actually doesn't have much of a bite. No, it, it doesn't. It, it's, it's strong. Yeah, it's, it's more of a bite. strong yeah. taste. Yeah. Yeah. You're, you're not. Real, get, I think it's real smooth. You're not yeah. getting that with this at all. You're not. No. This is really freaking good. Yeah. I, I was like, I like butane here. I, I thought it was gonna have a bite to it, but so did I. it doesn't, and it's real pleasant. Though. Now you're a, a big Guinness lover, <laughs> oh, but yeah. you're not really a huge fan of lagers, right? I, I usually just do stouts. I mean, I'll drink a few different others here and there, but I mean, mainly it's stouts. So I got this because I I really like Guinness. I like what they put out. I've had Smithwick's, which is from from Guinness, and that was pretty good too. So I figured yeah, it's not. For you. And not to mention. That was the last six pack on the rack, so I was like, it "Must be pretty popular." Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
How much did you pay for it? Eight forty nine. Eight forty nine. Right. So what do you think about it? It's good. That's <laughs> good. That's like <laughs> it. I, I, like I, had to, I had to agree. You know, I, yeah, I, I, like I definitely good. have to put my two cents in there. And I, I'm surprised. I thought it was going to have a little bit of a strong, strong ass bite to it, and it, it's so smooth. I think it's really smooth. Um, it's I like really the taste smooth. to it. I'm not digging it as much as everybody else, but uh, I mean, I, I'll it's, probably it's agree okay. with you a little bit. I mean, it's. Uh, I don't. I'm not gonna. I am not gonna go holy grail on this one. I'm, I'm not. Going I'm gonna to go it. decent because yeah. I like the taste. It's real super smooth, but to me, it falls a little flat. I it's agree. Kind of a flatness to it a little bit, like I the agree. aftertaste. Yeah, I agree. the taste goes away really quick. It's yeah, like kind of flat a little. I'll, bit. I was already. I already thought I was gonna go decent on this. Yeah, so. I think I'm gonna go decent on this one. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to say holy grail, and the reason why I say that is because. Guinness Stout is, I, I love it, love it. And um, this to me tastes a lot like it without the coffee right. hint to it. Yeah. Which I'm kind of eh on coffee anyway. It's just, <clears throat> so this is almost, I mean. This could be your new favorite. You know, it, it would it would be a toss up, honestly. I think yeah. this would this would be one of my lighter drinks because man, it, it takes a little bit to drink a lot of Guinness. It's pretty. It sure does. It's yeah. pretty, uh, Pretty filling, so yeah. yeah this may be That's my it's a stout. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this, yeah. This may be my uh, new go to My every day. Yeah. yeah. My. You know, it, it, it coming for me. I'm not. I'm not a hop head, and I'm not a stout drinker. I mean, I'll, I'll drink hops and I'll drink the stouts, but that's not my go to kind of drink. This I kind of like. You know, I, I could definitely see myself picking up a six pack of this and enjoying it. Mm -hmm. Um. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to go holy grail with it. Um, I don't think I'd switch it to my go-to drink, but it definitely would be one that I would like to switch up on and just toss in there as like, you know, a little change up. Mix it up. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Mix yeah. It up. I'm definitely going holy grail too. Alpine Spring. Along with uh, Butane and uh, Broadleaf here. <laughs> well, Alpine Spring was great. I got the, uh, <laughs> but that's only I got the German yeah. in me. I like the price. Um, I love the drink. This 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 is gonna be a definite definite go to drink. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Well, with uh, Nubs over here, I have German in me too, but I'm just gonna go decent. This is a I had German, German drink. Yeah. <laughs> from Ireland. <laughs> this is an Irish drink. <laughs> well, whatever. I mean, it's Guinness. Hey, I mean, Irish German beer. Whatever. Yeah. I mean, I just <laughs> I'm not too big on hops either. Um, I like lagers better than ales, but uh, this I know it's a lager, but I. I'll just go decent because, you know, like you said before, the taste is just flat. Yeah. Like after you drink it, you can taste it, and then once you swallow it, it's just the taste is just gone to me. So I'm just going to go decent on it. Yeah, I mean, it's not horrible. He's it's just not arguing mean, the pale ale. Well, it only has 4.5. <laughs> it's only 4.5, so. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's not like it's some big 5.7. It, it, it is something. really yeah. smooth, and I like I, I like how really smooth it is. Yeah. I, That's I what like shocked me, is how smooth yeah. it is. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. when I was pouring it, I'm like thinking, man, this is going to have a bite to it. <laughs> it's going to have a bite to it. But yeah, so man, I was, dark shit, I was, man. I was shocked. It surprised <laughs> the shit out of me. I was shocked at how smooth it was. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed. I, I am. No, I am too. I, hats off to Guinness. I mean, they can they can brew their shit. That's for sure. Because if you try their stout, man, that shit's the bomb. I just can't do too much of it, or I'm hitting the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Literally hitting the floor. Bombs for you? No. I might be able to do a couple. That's about it. I was yeah. like overall holy grail. Three out of five. Yeah. Three out of five. I mean, either way, I mean, we're pretty close. Either either way, you're, you're, it's, it's not bad. It, I'm like, teetering. So you get a decent rating. You, it, and good. the thing with our review is, you've got guys that love stout, you guys that love hops, yeah. you guys that like ales and lagers. So, I mean, you're, you're getting a, a good mix of reviews from people that like different things. Different styles, different, different things. Things. Yeah, yeah. I think I think most of the reviews will probably be it won't be unanimous. Exactly. Right. Exactly. Right. exactly. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have some and. For the most part, everybody can at least appreciate a different type. Than exactly. Yeah, yeah. So, and if, it is a, if it isn't all round good beer, they'll at least give it, you know, a good right. grade. But yeah, you know, it, it won't it, be a holy grail for them. And, and, that, and that's yeah, true. You know, we, we've, had, yeah. we've had hops, yeah. hoppy drinks that I've, you know, I've given a holy grail to, and I don't really care for hops. Yeah. But I mean, it's just you know, if it's a good yeah. beer, I'm going to say it's a good beer. If it's a shitty beer, it's unfortunately it's a shitty, shitty beer. beer. Yeah. Yeah. So and that's what we have the horse beer. Yeah, yeah. Some horse beer. Horse beer. Horse beer.
Yeah, too bad. <laughs> I think we need to bring some more shitty <laughs> beers again. Yeah, yeah we're gonna have to start. I know it sounds kind of crazy saying that, like, man, like, we gotta drink some shitty beer, but yeah, I, I think we need to start bringing that back a little bit. Yeah, we we, we need to. Yeah, we're gonna have to. We're, yeah, but you know I, what? I, being, I think so too. Being drinkers, it's hard to find a shitty beer unless you're really looking for a shitty beer. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Unless you're it's like, like saying, when we did the steel oh, reserves. This like is a when, shitty beer. Like when we did the steel reserves. How many people go to the supermarket, go to the gas station, where I'm gonna give me some steel reserve because that's the shit. <laughs> now, people don't drink that unless they want to get fucked up. <laughs> it was all right. I mean, I can drink a couple of them and get fucking tanked. <laughs> it wasn't shitty. It's just not my go-to drink. You know what I'm saying? Not the shit. It's exactly. Shitty. Right. So there are plenty of shitty beers out there. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> the thing is, that's the that's the problem with beer is. You know it's shitty though. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm saying. You have to actually there's, look for there's it. almost never an occasion where you're gonna drink a beer thinking it's gonna be awesome. Right. And then be like, God damn that's shitty. Right. <laughs> In fact, I'm uh I'm really considering um starting what? to do my own brew. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh okay. What were you gonna say, Nubs? No, uh, I thought we were doing what? Say a shitty beer that he was going to bring in. So. Oh. <laughs> like he has one already? Yeah. He's already got one picked up. Uh, he might make one. <laughs> in fact, I'm certain probably the first few that I do are going to be This first brewing attempt is going to be great for the crowd. Well, we can sure. review that there, uh, probably. <laughs> and if anyone wants samples, <laughs> feel sorry for you, but. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm good at cooking and stuff, so maybe yeah, maybe I can knows. incorporate that in and it's then an art. Good. Yeah. It's an art. All right. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, you have it. Uh, Guinness Black Lager. Looks like we definitely all agree on liking it, and the uh, general consensus overall is Holy Grail. Real smooth, even though it looks like it's going to have a bite. Really dark lager taste, even though it's still got that Guinness taste to it and just missing some of the coffee there. But great brew. Pick it up. 849 to six pack. This is Long Ashes. Bobby Butane, Gray Ashes, Nubs, and Broadleaf. We're going to continue to search for the Holy Grail event. We're doing it. Yeah. Cheers.